I'm gonna be surprising my mom by replanting her dead garden, starting with this little guy. Look at him, he's so cute. Now I just have to do that to this entire mess. Yeah, I know, I'm somehow gonna turn this into a flower bed. So let's take all these weeds down and I will hopefully restore the garden by the end of the day. Ah! I'm tripping over everything already. So after getting out the weed eater, almost taking 10 minutes to turn it on, and ripping apart the tree. I've got the power! Woo! Ah! <clears throat> Sorry, Mom. But to be fair, I began clearing out the weeds soon after. Although I could have done without the wasp. What the heck is that? Ah! Yeah, definitely not my proudest moment. But for being out of my element, I'm making pretty good time prepping mom's surprise garden. I even made a shocking discovery. Whoa! I completely forgot we had a fountain. Now that'd be a surprise if it could still work. I think I just talked myself into repairing it later. Well, foreshadowing aside, I took down the rest of the weeds and the difference from this morning had me flabbergasted. Oh my gosh, it's a plant massacre. Don't look little guy. All right, I'm gonna gather all the dead weeds, throw them out, and then I'll tell you the plan to replant the garden. Now, it's time I tell you the plan. There is none. I don't know how to garden, and if I were to plant the entire thing, it would cost me thousands. I barely have hundreds. <laughs> Fortunately, our neighbor knows a thing or two about gardening, so if I'm gonna learn how to plant for cheap, I'll have to meet with Josie. Hi, Alex. This is Josie. She's a plant mom, real mom, and agreed to help me surprise my mom. She'd also start off by telling me where I could find supplies for my surprise garden. I recommend if you're a beginner gardener, there's a lot of DIY things that you can do that you can put together on your own. And I would say you don't have to spend a whole lot of money to get started. My planter boxes out on the side of my house, we just used old wood and nailed them together. Nothing really fancy with gardening. It doesn't have to look beautiful or be extravagant. It just needs to hold plants. Now, unfortunately, I'm not that crafty. So instead, I got ready to go find a store when it really just started to hit me. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna be honest. I'm very nervous right now and very sweaty. <laughs> it's just that mom's been going through a lot lately and I really want this surprise garden to work. I wanna do something special for her. But before I go further, I'm gonna need to get to that store first. <laughs> oh, I'm in a panic. I made it to the store. I'm gonna go inside now. People are starting to look at me weird. <laughs> so I grabbed my cart, said hi to the skeleton, then began looking around. Say, do you got any grapes? Waddle waddle. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing or what I should get. I would say that you'd need some topsoil, some mulch, some gardening fabric, and some gardening fabric pins. All right, we're making good progress, but I still haven't chosen any flowers. I don't really know what ones to get. I would say I prefer perennials, which are ones that come back each year. It really just depends on what you prefer to do, but you should be fine if you buy annuals. Mounding annual, spring, summer, hey, it says summer, and they're three bucks a pop. I'll take it. All right, it looks like we've got everything we'll need, which is good, because mom should be coming home from work in about two hours. I should probably check out now. <laughs> Woo! That's up pretty quick. Yes, it does. <laughs> and here I thought I was gonna make it out for cheap. But spending that crazy amount of money wasn't the only punch to the gut I'd have today. <laughs> Oh, that knock went out of me. After recovering, I started packing up the plant supplies, strapping in baby, that's his name now, and we began driving home where I thought more about mom's garden because I know she's been wanting to have a actual garden for so long now. So I figured why not surprise her with one, but I gotta get home and then I'll tell you the plan for the garden.
Okay, it doesn't look like a car's here. It looks like we're gonna just make it. And we do have some leftover pathway stone. I think that would look pretty cool as a walkway through the garden. Now, just to make sure I don't mess this up, I'll need some more advice. I would say um, putting down your soil first and making sure you till it up real nice so the dirt is loose. After you've put the soil down, just place your gardening fabric on top and then secure it with your pins. Now that your fabric pin is down, you can put your mulch on top of that. Once you have put your mulch on top of the fabric, I would go ahead and just dig a hole big enough for your plant to securely put it down and just make sure that each of your plants are spaced evenly. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Yippee, it's baby and little guy. All right, let's get that pathway done. Take care of the fountain. Mom should be home any minute. Check this out. Bop, beep, boop, bloop, bow, wow. Okay, let's fix this heckin' well. Which, by some miracle, the thing that spits out the water turned out to be fine. But now I have a bigger problem, cause I accidentally broke the bucket that holds oh. all the fountain water. Oops. There's a big old crack, the water will just go right through. What if I use a trash bag? Will that stop the water? It may be a little trashy. I'll be here all night. All right, now let's fill it up. Yeah, that didn't exactly go to plan. <laughs> Good thing I put a trash bag in there. But with time running out, I'm becoming pretty desperate. So I tried using a trash bag again, and funnily enough, it worked. That's so cool. Oh, my little garden. Our little garden. Mom's garden. Okay, I'm gonna turn this off and then it's time to surprise her. Oh, mother, I've got a surprise for you. What kind of surprise? You have to go to the backyard and see. Okay, can I change my clothes first? Today has been crazy, but I really do think it's gonna be worth it. I wasn't quite sure what I was doing the whole time, but I had a great mentor, and even with everything being complete, I still feel like there's one more step I'm forgetting. The last thing that you'll need to make your garden better than the rest is a little bit of love. Oh my god. <laughs> what do you think? Oh, it's pretty. Okay. Yeah, it looks awesome. Got one more thing to show you. Keep your eyes right there at the fountain. That is really cool, Alex. Ah. Uh, hugs! <laughs> uh, I love you, Mama. I love you, too. So the takeaway from this video? Tell your mom you love her. Maybe even watch another video together.